Hello Aquarius, welcome to your December reading for love. <clears throat> so I'm connecting with all of you Aquarius watching my video. Setting my intention that whoever needs to hear this message, I hope that cards will give some meaningful insights. The main card for you, the main lesson, <laughs> laziness, okay. The inner, the journey, the outer energy, lucidity. What you should do, <laughs> okay, mind and abundance. So, Aquarius. What I can see for you guys that you have a lesson to learn in when it comes to okay when it comes to challenging yourself to see this lazy man here his he thinks that he can just that it is the right time for him to just, you know, put on his slippers, his robe, and just relax, and thinking that that's, that's all that he needed to do, like, he's content with himself. But his illusion is about to break, see this glass here breaking? This illusion is about to break, and he will soon need to learn that he will need to go beyond his boundaries and um challenge himself to do more and ask of more of himself it's about not being lazy with where you think you are it's about um being active and challenging your don't be lazy in your opinions don't be lazy in your thinking don't be like challenge yourself don't stay there where you think that that's okay because you, you need to grow you need to evolve and you cannot grow and evolve if you just stay where you are uh, if you don't challenge yourself um, there is a new journey for you starting Aquarius there's this this feeling of new journey new road that you you must take something new in your relationship your um, if you are with someone they're making you see something they're trying to wake you up and they're letting you know that on this uh, that you need to I think this has to do with challenging your mind see mine here the mind the card that has fixed ideas has you know rules and this is how it should be and this is the I think you, you need to challenge your mind you need to Be aware of what you're telling yourself and um, this is, yeah, this is the, 
Knight of Swords. The you need to challenge the way you you were thinking before. You need to challenge certain patterns in your mind. Certain um, beliefs and the way you were thinking about things, the way you were and this also has to do with abundance this man here it's a male energy of um, this is um, the pentacles, the coins about abundance but it has to do with it's a male energy so it has to do with um, action you need to take action about something you need to change the way you view things the way you thought of things and you need to challenge your beliefs because if you're lazy in remaining in one type of mentality you cannot find abundance so for you to find abundance and um, you need to challenge something in the way you you think you need to go beyond and don't be lazy in your thinking don't be lazy like remaining in the same ideas that you had before that is laziness like not willing to change them not willing to um, see things from another perspective you're content with the way you view things you're content to do with the way you're thinking things but you actually you need to challenge this and um, your significant other is kind of letting you know <laughs> It, it's it's trying to make you see things for how they are and it's trying to it's challenging you to become better to become abundant and this is like a new journey that you've embarked upon with this this is a new thing this is a new path this is something new starting for you this there's a there's a sense of new Things you have to acquire now in your life. You need to step up to the new level, to a new level. And this this person in your life is helping you, is somehow um, helping you realize this and achieve this. Uh, it's helping you go over your boundaries, go over. It's challenging you to, to get off your chair, to get off your ass and to change your attitude, to change your thinking and to start on this path with uh, accepting other perspectives, accepting others, with, with seeing more and than you could see before, with accepting more something that you maybe had resistance to accept before. So you're being challenged to sort of evolve into a more abundant self in a you know to, to become abundant and have uh, you know where you need to be. Um, <clears throat> if you're single then you're kind of being challenged by whatever is in your outside environment. You're being challenged to see that the way you've done things before, it's not right, it's not, you're stuck. You're just stuck there, you're not moving, you're not. And on this new road, you have to travel, it's like new level for you, a new level. You have to challenge yourself. And you have to improve yourself in the way you think. And 
change your attitude maybe try to see something else maybe try to see the truth in something else that you didn't want to see before maybe try to acknowledge something that you had maybe resistance in acknowledging it's about you challenge the way you think the way you used to think and shift your perspective and in this way like with the changed mind and a changed of views changed change of uh, perspective on this new road uh, this will help you to fulfill your desires and have what you want um, so in a relationship if you want to be in harmony and abundant in a relationship you need to step up you need to step up and uh, change the way you think and or, or at least challenge uh, at least be willing to challenge the way you think to challenge your yourself to go further to go beyond and to not stop because you're not done if you want to have a balanced relationship and to reach abundance you have to take these steps to challenge yourself and yeah and your your significant other is kind of helping you to realize this that you need to change something um If you are in a new relationship, like it's a new something new starting, you you'll come to re realize that <laughs> there's a uh, you need to, as I said, uh, develop. You, you need to change something. Because this, this new person that is in your life is not vibing with the way you used to think. It's not vibing with the way you used to do things. And if you want to take this new journey with this person and reach abundance and have a successful relationship, you need to challenge yourself. And this person will help you see. It's helping you see where you're not um, doing enough when you're not where you're not um you know where you're you're stuck and it's helping you see uh the truth and the the things that you need to change not for their sake but for your sake for for your sake, for your own abundance, for your own journey. So, Aquarius, <laughs> I hope this resonated at least with a few of you. Uh, and if it didn't resonate, it's okay. I will do more readings in every week. Oh, God, I hate this word resonate. I gotta find a new one. <laughs> Okay, if you don't, if you didn't connect, okay, if you didn't connect with this reading, then maybe next reading I will have a message for you. And if you did connect, then I'm glad that I could give you a perspective, uh, something to think about. Anyways, I love you guys and take care and see you in my next video. Bye bye, Aquarius.